Hi, I'm LaQuisha Jackson from Advent Health, Heart of Florida, and this is Advent Health TV. Hi everyone, I'm Tom Johnson. The 2019 Community Health Needs Assessment is out. The Community Health Needs Assessment for Lake, Orange, Osceola, and Seminole Counties is a detailed 711-page report based on more than 2,700 surveys. It helps us set campus-by-campus -campus community health plans and strategies. And the ultimate goal of the CHNA is actually to develop very targeted plans that address the health care needs of that particular community. The four-county CHNA shows four major themes as areas of greatest need care coordination, mental and behavioral health, community development, and food insecurity. CHNA is also just completed for Volusia and Flagler counties. The priority issues identified in Volusia County include adult and youth behavioral health, cardiovascular diseases and diabetes, barriers to accessing health care, healthy eating and physical activity, plus social and economic issues. In Flagler County, the priority issues again include adult and youth behavioral health, as well as cardiovascular diseases and diabetes, but also mothers and children under age five and family violence. These are our residents, these are our family members, these are our neighbors, and we need to extend health to them. We also just announced a unique partnership with Seminole County to combat the ongoing opioid epidemic publicly launching a multifaceted partnership. The announcement made at Advent Health Altamont Springs, a key element of the partnership, is a new addictions recovery center in this Sanford building. When fully operational, the center will house up to 40 men and 10 women and provide up to 30 days of overnight care. First class clinical facility that when people walk in, they feel like they're walking into any one of the Advent Health facilities, any one of the hospitals. The partnership includes a substance abuse navigator based out of the Advent Health Altamont Springs ER. The navigator helps patients during stays and for 30 days after discharge. We're treating the person. The person is much more than a one-time visit. All of this aimed at cutting down on the 80 opioid deaths and 650 overdoses last year in Seminole County alone. If we can wrap our arms around them and begin to get them connected to a level of support and care where they can be feel whole again, I mean, I, I don't know what else could be more profound in our mission than that. Central Florida families have a new choice for emergent care. Advent Health Celebration opening a brand new pediatric emergency room. The kid-friendly unit is designed in a way that eases the fear and anxiety of an ER visit and keeps pediatric patients separate from adult patients. Are you hungry? Perhaps looking for a good read that will help you feel healthy and whole? Well, we have something cooking that you might be surprised to learn. Chefs we want to see more liquid in here. Are like artists in some ways, always working to make their creations. There's no green. Should we do some something greener on top? Perfect. Beautiful. Diabetes Institute executive chef Edwin Cabrera, no exception. But this day, his culinary art intersects with visual art. A high-end photo shoot with Advent Health photographer Spencer Freeman. The pics are for a new book from Advent Health Press. What's that you say? You did not know we had a publishing arm? Well, oh, wow. that's Todd Shobatar. He runs it and he says, you're not alone. A lot of people tell him, wow, I didn't know that we had a press at uh, Advent Health. We do, around 70 books published in the last 15 years. Most of them taking a look at areas of whole person health. The latest is this beauty by Dr. George Guthrie. Eat plants, feel whole. Filled with all these gorgeous photos and more than 50 recipes. Taking plant-powered food and enhancing the health and healing properties of our own bodies. It's abstract cabbage. That does almost look like an abstract painting. The latest from a robust publishing house right under our own roof, or in this case, in our kitchen. Every day is a new adventure. Now a look at a great idea taking root at Advent Health Daytona Beach. The Giving Tree is planted on a wall in the Imaging Department. Our picture of the week is used as a way to recognize fellow team members with a compliment or a story for praise or recognition. The leaves added recently to showcase compliments from patients. What a great way to highlight team members living up to our service standards. Hey, if you want to see your team on Advent Health TV, 
Send us your photos and videos. You can email them to us at adventhealthtv at adventhealth.com. We'll see you next time.